What it do, Little Rock's family? It's your boy, Little Rock, and we're back with another video. Thank you guys for staying in tune. This video that I'm doing, that we're gonna talk about, is um, it's the fame. Let me see what it is again. Me and my girl went to this poetry thing, and it's for like other rappers and artists and poets and musicians and music like express their feelings and let them know how it is and they can express their feelings on there and and enjoy their music so it's, it wasn't that packed but it was good so we went there so we had a good time it's in neptune building dreams inspiring motivation events present dreamers fire artist night so the artists come there and they they, they deliver the music they um expressions all that you know and i never went to that so my friend she did that and she told me yo you should come over and support us and everything else and you know and everybody in there and it's my birthday so i'm like all right bet i said let me get to my wife and let me see if i could talk to her and she will come down there you know so we did all that so we went down there that friday and we had a good time. Like we sent my daughter to to my mother's, and she spent a quality time over there. She had fun with my daughter, and they had an amazing time. So I hope we do that again. And um, it was fun. So the Dream event is basically on like it's about poetry, poems, comedy, hip hop, inspirational network. So that they had like big people out there, you know what I'm saying? Like all around. And it was good. It was good. It was really good. Build a dreams. Inspired. They did the thing on that. Like and it's crazy because my girl, she went up on there too. So she was like, yo, I don't know if I should go and this and that. I was like, we already hear everything, what they do and how they do it. You might as well, you know what I'm saying? So she was like, all right, let me look up this poem that I made and I did. Let me look up this poem that I did. And um, if I find it, then I'll come up there and express my feelings on the poem and let them know how I feel on the poem. I said, yeah, you should, yo, it's good. And I looked at it, I read it. I was like, wow, you should definitely do this. And she was like, oh. I don't know, and this, I'm like, no, babe, you should go, like, go ahead and do it. Like, I got your back. I'm always happy back. So, I wouldn't even let you, put you down like that, you know what I'm saying, if I wasn't sure, you know what I'm saying? I know you got that fire in you. So this fire is called Dreamers of Fire, because I know she got that fire inside her. She could release that, you know, and she did an amazing job, yo. She did an amazing job. I was like, yo, I'm happy for you. Because when she go to school or work, she has to um, present herself and get get off that comfort zone, you know what I'm saying? Like you have to talk, you know, you have to tell people this and that. That's your job, you know, that's how I do it. So um, I, didn't go up I didn't go up there and say what I have to say. I wanted to, but I didn't even to do that. Like I felt like it's, I wanted to come out here to film and support my friend in her event so that's what i did so um shout out to Mella rose you check that out you know what i mean um i told her i'm gonna be doing this so um right now i'm not gonna post the video yet this is this is the monk bank we're talking about it she did an amazing job yo my girl did a major job she did a major job everybody else did a major job and it, it was fun you know I definitely want to do that again. I'm not gonna lie. Definitely want to do that again. Like I'd rather go to um stuff like that than um going to maybe like hip hop artists and stuff like that. But like, I don't know. I think that that atmosphere is more chill. You know what I'm saying? Y'all let me know. You think it's chill or not? I think it is. Cause it's like so many riots and fighting when you go to the um, 
you know what I'm saying? Like jazz and, and, and poetry and all that. I think that's more mellow and calm down, you know, everybody can support each other and let y'all know how you feel. And I like that. You know what I mean? That was that was a good energy and that joint was nice. So that's what we're gonna talk about today. My iced tea from McDonald's. I don't know if you can see that. On oh, a million. I wish I was. Got my fries. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, that was a good event, yo. I don't. I'm sure you got some more. That I could go to, and maybe next time I, I'll, I'll come up there and present myself and let nobody else know that I'm a YouTuber. And you should follow my channel, man. I mean, my channel is mad lit. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing everything and anything. I mean, just for you guys and myself. Cause I like doing what I'm doing. I'm not gonna lie. A couple of days I had a feeling. I was like, yo. Should I stop doing YouTube? Cause the reason why I said that, because like your mindset is not clear. When your mindset is not clear, when you wanna post videos and do things and people behind your back or anybody just bringing you down and that like it messed your head up and be like you know what this what this is what I do I do YouTube this is what I do it's my life I work but this is my life this is like a part-time job people don't understand YouTube is like a job either part-time or full-time you have to be on your a game you have to present videos you have to you have to do what you have to do you know what i'm saying if you don't got that mindset this is not for you you know what i'm saying so if if i was that person i would tell that person like go oh, chill out like relax like have a have a good mindset you know what i'm saying be happy be joy because what that person is doing could benefit all of us. You never know, you know what I'm saying? So when you got that negative mindset and somebody had a positive mindset and trying to do something, don't try to knock that person down, you know, because that's, that's gonna make everything will be bad. It's like you're, I mean, you to be around that person. You don't want to be around that person no more. You know what I'm saying? Or or that day or that time when you when you post the videos or anything like that no it should be all together like you know what i'm saying when you do that when when that person actually get to where where i'm at they fully understand why you have to post videos why you have to be like that that way you gotta do this how you do that it's a reason youtube is no joke youtube is like a part-time and full-time job that's why most people go to the stores or events or anywhere in general and post videos because that's something you need to remember for the rest of your life when you be like, oh my God, I posted videos. I went out with my kids to a music park and we had a good time, you know what I'm saying? And you go there and you have fun, but you got nothing to show for it. This is why you have to record every event and this and that, because you could look back at it. I'm like, oh damn, you remember we went to SeaWorld, you remember we went to Disney World, you remember when we went to over here, you went to the music park, we did this, you did that. Yeah, so when you look back at the picture and on the videos, like, yo, we could reminisce that over and over. But if you don't record nothing, you just go out and have a good time, take pictures that's fine but it was the video you know what i'm saying like 
you could look back at it every time. You know what I'm saying? And that's the best feeling. You're like, yo, I did this with my daughter. I did this with my girl. We had an amazing time at the music park. We had a good time. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn. I ain't got nothing for show for it. Now when you do record, you're like, all right, we got it. You can post it on YouTube. You can look at it on your phone. And you just like, it brings it brings joy. You know what I'm saying? This is, this is the same way with the YouTube when you post videos. It's the same thing. You know what I mean? You're delivering good content to people and yourself because you're taking the time to post these videos out. You know what I'm saying? Man. That's where it's at. And I love what I do and I hope this person will follow my footsteps and just do what what we do, like YouTubers do. And just relax and chill. You know what I'm saying? It's not that serious. You know what I'm saying? So we'll see what happens because I was this close to quitting YouTube. I feel like I didn't want to do it no more. Because it's always, it's always something negative, you know what I'm saying? And, and that's not how I am. I'm a happy, joy, humble person. You know what I'm saying? I like to do things. So, if y'all feel like that, y'all let me know. Because stuff like that will really will pull a toll on you. I was like really, I was like really, I was really upset a little bit. Like, I'm like, for real, yo. I was like, yo, maybe I don't want to do it no more, yo. But I can't think like that because I work so hard for where I'm at. You know what I'm saying? And I just want you guys to know that. And I got more videos coming on the way. So this is the monk bait. So I'm just chilling, yo. I'm really just chilling right now. <clears throat> I'm just chilling. Yo, look at this. I had this for a while. So now they're going to jump back. It's called the. What's that? What's it called? The glazed tender. You know I had to go for that. And I got my burger, got my fries still. You know what I'm saying? And I'm on. I got my drink. Oh my god. That's crazy. So y'all let me know how y'all day is. What did y'all do today? How you feel about this video? If I'm right or wrong, like, you know what I mean, with the YouTube thing, like, you got somebody in your personal life, could be your friend, family, anybody like that, that's just, like, you could post the videos all the time, but when they, when you do it, they always got something to say, or they just, like, shy for the camera. Or they don't want to, they don't want that to be done. Nah. Mmm. Right, good kickback. I ain't that for a long time. Oh my god. It's good. Yeah man. Y'all let me know. So I'm about to post two videos today because I ain't post one last week so I'm making it up today I told you guys I got y'all man I got y'all man I ain't got nothing to worry about I got y'all this right here it's the monk bank a little rock and family all right Hope you guys like that. And I'm sorry you guys off make y'all feel like I don't think I was gonna be done with YouTube. I really thought I was, yo. 
I was really be done with this. I was gonna hang it up. But I was I had to think about it, I'm like, nah. Can't do that. <laughs>